Swan went in Newcastle upon Tyne, um, first diagnosed in 2020 with a fatty liver disease. My blood tests were normal, so I carried on as normal. Carried on eating the same food, doing what I've always done, thinking nothing would change. I missed the fibrosis stage and went straight into cirrhosis due to lockdown. It was a shock. Fibrosis, you can reverse it, but cirrhosis, you can't. There's no cure, there's no reversal. As you gave me, you said you've got about 10 to 12 years. And I mean, travelling home, I'm thinking I'd not see the town more anymore, and I wouldn't be here for my husband to care for him. We haven't got anybody to help us, we've got no family, no children or anything. So if I go, he's going to have to go in a home. And I didn't know where to go, where to look for help or anything like that. But then I heard of the British Liver Trust and that's when I looked them up and found all the information that I needed there. I advise anybody to get in touch with them when they first find out, go to the Liver Trust and everything is there on their page and that's helped find out what it was and apparently with diet and exercise you can slow it down uh, which I did when I heard before I saw the doctor I stopped everything I stopped all my painkillers stopped eating chocolate biscuits scones I never eat fruit or veg since I've been up here just lived on microwave meals because we're so busy with work and hobbies and charities it's quicker just to shove a meal in the microwave I stopped all that and the weight just dropped off and I lost, between the phone call and seeing the first appointment with Dr Donnelly, I'd lost over three stone. I wouldn't have thought it was possible. I've been on diet all my life, crash diets, diet tablets. But it just proves if you cut out the wrong food and then exercise, the weight will just drop off. Um, I went from a size 22 down to a 14, now I'm in a 12. The doctor said it's the the weight loss is really the fat around the liver that's reduced and that's helped. But there needs to be a lot more information out there about fatty liver and explain to the patients more about what it is, how they got it, what they can do about it, how to change the lifestyle. That's all it is, change the lifestyle. When I saw my doctor on the 1st of April, and I've said, oh, a year's gone by already, that's only nine or 11 years left now. She goes, oh, hopefully you'll have a lot longer than that. If you stay as you are, and the blood tests are still normal. At the minute, I feel great. I've got more energy than I've had in a long time. <laughs> I've run up the stairs now. <laughs> Even my doctor says, go and enjoy the new body. But it shows you what you do in a younger life. You know, eat your fruit, eat your veg and everything before this happens. <laughs>